So I just wanted to quickly show you guys something. Almost 70% of the people that consistently watch my videos are not subscribed to the channel. Please make sure you guys go down and check to see if you are subscribed to me. Hit that notification bell. Let's see if we can bump that up to like 50, 60% of the people. Help me reach my goal of hitting 100,000 subscribers. The last time I used the Milano, I targeted more of a no recoil approach, but this time I wanted to go the movement route, focusing less on recoil. Uh, this is a very good aggressive weapon because of the high damage. Uh, but at the same time, if you, it's also fairly decent at range, actually. That's where I wanted to go with that. Fairly decent range, again, because of the high damage. But there's your kind of movement I was talking about. It's got a great stray speed. There was the guy here. I don't know where he went. That must have been him. He's going to turn around, right? my god they're just like rats they keep pouring out and out and out and i can't do anything about it all right this game's going very fast like we're at 14. oh i actually got that nade kill they are literally like rats oh my god there's a guy up here All right, let's see what we can do. Where are they at? I guess I'll just drop it back there. It appears I am in their spawn. Okay, yeah, it really appears I'm in their spawn. They're hunting me like crazy, dude. Yeah, yeah, right here. Nuke is possible. I'm not going to claim it to be extremely probable, but it does have the possibility here. I think they're all upstairs. Two piece. That guy is definitely upstairs. Uh, mm. I don't know where this guy is. I'm just going to go this way. Yeah, they're all around me. Dad. Oh, I tried so hard, man. They just swarm when they could, when they enter a building. It is like a, an actual swarm of human beings. I'm gonna go with this. We're gonna lay down here. Dude, this is so quick. This is one of the fastest games I think I've ever played on this game. It was worth it. I ended up taking my, uh, ending my, well, I don't even think I was on a streak actually. Was I? I think I was only on like one. What can you do? I mean, I'm rounding a corner next to a Mac 10. That's one of those. Yeah, you're not beating me again. Nah.
Yeah, you thought. Oh, I'm surrounded. I'm surrounded. Anybody? I hear you. Nope, not this time. Somebody else on my team got a harp. I got 50. They're all up there. Could you imagine if I would have snapped onto that guy? Oh, he would have gotten the Schmeet. That was a six minute recording. My goodness. 52 and five. That cruise ship or yacht. It's a yacht, right? It's not a crew. Yeah, it's a yacht. The Von Voyage is rat infested. My goodness, every time I round a corner, there'd be four of them. Well, they were traveling in packs. It felt like I was playing Rebirth Island against quads. I couldn't just, I could, couldn't get a second to breathe, man. I vibe with it. That's my type of game right there. I love that kind of intensity. I love that kind of pace. Man, what can I say? Let's get into these attachments, get into the business here. My first attachment is the Muzzle Break 9. That is going to give you a little bit of recoil control to help you with your medium range fights while not having any cons to running it. Down here to a barrel, I do have the 8.9 inch extended. That's going to increase your bullet velocity. Again, it's going to help you a bit at range by helping your bolts connect a little quicker. And again, we have zero cons to running this attachment. That's kind of the theme of this entire build here is giving you movement or not taking anything away for the underbarrel i do have the bruiser grip gaining all that movement it's only three percent values but that does add up at the end of the day for the handle we're going to get the airborne elastic grab here for the maximized aim down sight speed that's what really gave it that fast and snappy aim down sight speed along with that we're getting that 90 percent to the flinch resistance and ability to drop shot and our final attachment here is going to be the raider stock giving you a 30 percent increase towards your sprint to fire speed and 10 percent to the aim walking speed. This was definitely one of the more fun builds I've put on the channel so far. I think I'm gonna do more of these movement builds if you guys are interested. So if you guys wanna see that, make sure you go down to the comment section to let me know. Make sure you guys are also hitting the like and subscribe button. As always, I'll see you guys in the next one.